One of Republicans' biggest talking points lately has been the, quote, crisis at the border. The crisis at the border. Joe Biden's open border catastrophe. The Socialist Democrats have not only brought chaos and bedlam to the border, they brought every bad thing you can have to this border. This border is a disaster. This is the first time ever I'm aware of that a governor had to make a disaster declaration for the border situation, and yet that's exactly what we did. They're not even looking at the border. We have a huge problem going on today. It's a crisis and it's chaos. What might have started out as a pure talking point has become much more. Republican governors across the country are sending National Guard and state troopers down to the border to assist with the so-called crisis. Let's be clear, though, this is nothing more than political theater. The thinking goes like this. If Republicans talk about the issue enough and make it big enough stink, they believe they can convince people that there's a real problem. They are trying to create the illusion of a threat. But they really should be looking inward to the problems in their own states. Last month in Tennessee, a group of white nationalists marched in downtown Nashville. They were chanting, reclaim America, and handing out white supremacist propaganda. Then in South Dakota, suicide rates are on the rise, prompting concerns of a mental health crisis. And Iowa saw a record number of gun deaths last year, but still got rid of a law requiring a permit to carry a handgun. So Governors Lee, Governors Noem and Reynolds, instead of spending time and resources sending troops to the border, you may want to focus on issues facing your own state because it seems like you've got your own crises to deal with before the issues are calling a crisis at the border. Try looking inward. Hi, I'm Zerlina Maxwell. Thanks for checking out our channel on YouTube. You can see more from Zerlina by clicking any of the videos on this screen and make sure you subscribe below to stay up to date on the day's biggest stories. Thanks for watching.